Hey guys! Today I am going to be doing an opening and review of two Our Generation items that I got. I got these pajamas. It is like a romper, but it's pajamas, and it comes with sandals and a little robe. And I got this big accessory set, and I'm really excited to show you guys, so let's get into the video. So now that we've opened the box, I can show you guys the outfit. So the first piece I'm going to show you is the robe that it comes with. This is really cute. It's a really nice cotton gray material and it has little orange stripes all across it. And I like how it's random and it's not perfectly in order. And in the back to keep this um, little string attached to the robe, it is sewn right there on the back, but that doesn't really bother me because it's not that noticeable. Although I do kind of wish that they use like a gray um, thread instead of like a white thread. But in the front, it has this little knot in it. So when you put the robe on your doll, you can just tie it around there or you can leave it down, but it easily comes undone. And it also has a little tag that says OG and that's just sewn on there. I wouldn't suggest taking it off because you would have to get like a seam ripper and then just take the whole thing off and you might ruin the cotton of the robe. The next piece I'm going to show you is the pajamas and this looks just like a romper. It's all one piece. It has um it's like elastic right here but I don't think there's any elastic inside it. I'm not really sure though and it's really cute. It is also a kind of grayish fabric. It's lighter than the other one. It could even be like a really light blue. It has um, stars and it has a little moons, like those are like quarter moons. And in the front where it's all bunched up like that, it has this really cute bow. And the same fabric is used for a border on the top and the straps and around the side. And these are really cute. I really like them. The last piece in this set are the shoes. And they are plastic, but they're actually not that bad of a plastic. I mean, I wouldn't think that AG would make their shoes like this. Because I do know that they have a pair that are black and white that they used to sell. I don't know if they sell them anymore. Um, but these are actually really cute. They're like a coral color. And they actually fit on American Girl doll's feet which is nice because this is a different brand. So here's the outfit on my new doll, Rebecca, and I think it looks really cute, but one of the sandals was actually kind of hard to put on, and it was only one of them, and I'm not sure why, but I'm sure it was only mine. Why don't you let me stop by? The clock is ticking, running out of time. So we should party all So I have to say that like opening that package did take a lot longer than the other one but it's just because it had a lot of pieces so to start off with the pieces i'm going to start off with the food items so there are two slices of pizza in it and i believe that they're pepperoni pizza um this one is lighter than this one so this one might be pepperoni and this one might be like sausage or something i'm not really sure i'm like allergic to pizza so i don't really eat it but the final food items are these two cupcakes, which I think are really cute. One is red and one is blue. And this is a little, like, not um, related to this. But these would be great for 4th of July. If you're going to have, like, a little, like, 4th of July party for your dolls, these would be great. Um, so next, I'm going to show you guys this little deck of cards. And it actually can open because there are cards inside of it. And I'll show you guys that. So you have to be really careful when you're opening this because you might break the cardboard just like with the normal deck of cards. But all of the cards are in there and they're not glued together because I feel like American Girl would probably glue them together. But they actually have like all the things on it. Like that's an ace and then I just saw two. Um, there's kings, there's jacks, there's everything. And I think that's really cool how they added the detail with all of that. And inside the little plastic that was holding this inside of the box, 
there was this little cardboard piece that has a king, an ace, and a joker. And they're all connected. Um, I don't really know if you guys would want to use this. I'm just going to recycle it. But you guys can do whatever you want with it. And I almost forgot to show you guys these two plates that come with it. And this is for the food. I probably should have showed you guys this with the food, but I forgot. So the next item in the set is really cute. And I'm really glad I picked the set up because I actually don't have any of these for my dolls yet. And it's just a little iPod. And the screen is just gray. And it's kind of sparkly, which I thought was cool. And it looks like a normal iPod with the home button. Um, but this one has a heart around it. And on the back, it has the R Generation logo which i thought was really cool and it also comes with these little earbuds that can be plugged in and taken out of the ipod like if you want to use this as a pretend phone for your dolls the next item in the set is really cool and it is a hair straightener for your dolls it doesn't work but if you have like a doll with straight hair you can take it and just pretend to straighten their hair or even with a curly hair doll and make it like straighter um, but it also has this on and off button. It doesn't move. I kind of wish that it does, but I'm really glad that they added this, even if it doesn't move. The next item is a hair curler for your doll. I think it's really cute. It opens and closes if you push this little thing right here, which I thought was really cool. If you can see that. It has, like, the little hinge, and it's absolutely adorable. But it has this big long slit in it, and I have a hair curler like this, and mine doesn't have that. I'm not sure why it does, um, because even if this was like being pushed back, it can't get pushed back that far. So I'm not sure why that they added that. The next item is this little tube of toothpaste, and I think that it is adorable. It says Dentifice on it, and it's probably mint flavored because there's mint leaves on it, and it's green. Um, it says toothpaste on the other side, but it has like the same design and the cap doesn't come off But I wasn't really expecting it to but I think it's really cool how they added like the little slits in the cap like there are on normal toothpaste The next item is really cute. It is this little toothbrush for your doll It's perfectly sized for them and I need another one because I only have one But I think it's adorable and it's a really cute thing to add to the set the next thing that comes in the set is this really cute pillow. It's blue and it's fluffy and it's gonna go great for any dollhouse. And on the other side, it's kind of like a satin. It's definitely not real satin, but it's really soft like satin is. And this is just like really cute. The next item in the set, and probably one of my favorites, is this big sleeping bag. It's absolutely adorable. It has the little R Generation tag on it. And like I said with the rope from earlier, you probably don't want to take this off with like a seam ripper because you're probably going to ruin the fabric. But it's adorable. The bottom has this little flower design on it and it's all the way across the back, this flower design. But on the front, there is this polka dot design on the top and it actually fits your dolls really nicely. I like it a lot. The last and final item from this set is this adorable bag for you to put all of the stuff in. And it is stuffed with this paper right now, just so it looks full. But of course you can take that out, I'm going to right now. And it has a zipper on top so you can open and close the bag. And it's absolutely adorable. I really love this a lot. It's great for vacations even if you're not having a doll sleepover. And this bag now has all of the accessories in it, except for the pillow and the sleeping bag, because those are a little bit too big. But it fits perfectly, and there's still more room for, for some other things if you want to add more things to your doll's bag for when they go over to their friend's house for a sleepover. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. It helps me grow my channel. And I have all the links for you guys to purchase these two sets in the description box below.